TGIF, TGIF, everyone, it's the weekend. Hope you guys have a wonderful weekend ahead. So today, I would love to share about tea. Um, I love drinking tea and coffee at the same time. But for now, tea is number one. So I would love to share six country of tea that I have on hand right now. What kind of tea I drink? Where do I buy the tea? And why do I drink this kind of tea? So let's start with Malaysia, the country that I live. Malaysia have a few brand of the tea. At the moment, I like to drink ball. So this is a new packaging. This tea is planted on Cameron Highland. A region, a city. I'm not sure whether it is a city or not. So sorry, my geography fell. Cameron Highland is a very cool place, suitable for tea planting in Malaysia. So if you guys want to visit Malaysia, please go to Cameron Highland as well. You will get tea, you will get strawberry, you will get a lot more other plant there, and a lot more, a lot more thing to, a lot more place to visit as well. So, this tea, the brand called Bo. This is a gold blend, which is only available to purchase when you go to the manufacturer in Cameron Highland. Uh, I didn't go to Cameron Highland yet, but Aaron did. So when Aaron visit Cameron Highland, he also went to the tea plantations and bought home a few type of ball, which is specialized in black tea, and one of the tea that only can purchase in Cameron Highland is this. They call it Gold Blend. So let's move forward to Thailand. So uh, back to I think few years ago when I visit Thailand, I realized that Thailand have tea plantation as well. Of course, I didn't get to visit any plantation yet, but hope in future I'm able to visit some of uh, tea plantation in Thailand. Therefore, I did buy some tea that I think is quite special that I didn't get this kind of tea in Malaysia. This tea I bought about, uh, I think, one or two years ago. So this tea is called Butterfly Pea Herba Tea. So this is how it looks like. So this flower actually have some color it's a natural color so when you uh, when you put hot water into the tea bag the color is actually come out it's light purple color the tea actually look nice uh, this is a herba tea not exactly tea tea if you know what i mean the benefit of it is actually anti-oxidized improved system Improved system, okay, I don't know why it says improved system blood circulations. Maybe some spelling error, I'm not sure. Uh, and then it helps to relieve thirsty and reduce sugar level in blood. Hmm. Good, good for health. Moving forward is the country where I love their oolong tea, oolong cha which is Taiwan. I bought a few type of their oolong tea. However, uh, I finish it, I finish almost uh, half of it. Therefore, I only left two type of tea that I can show in the video. So this is, uh, this is a type of oolong tea in a packaging like this. The shop name is Yo Ming Cha. 
They started their business in 18th century, 1890. This company have been around for more than 100 years. So it's a century company. Um, before I bought this tea, I actually get to try uh, I get to try to drink different different kind of uh, oolong tea first before I decided to buy. So this type of oolong tea is called High Mountain Oolong Tea. I assume, I cannot confirm, that it was planted on Highland, <laughs> High Mountain. So there are a few types. Uh, I love roasted. I also love original taste. And I also love a strong taste of oolong tea. Uh, I love it when it's hot and also when it's cold. No sugar added, of course. I strongly recommend if you go to Thailand, eh, sorry, if you go to Taiwan, you can try this type of tea. There's a lot of different kind of oolong tea in, Ta in Taiwan that you can try. You can ask around and if you have time, you can go and visit their factory as well, which is located uh, quite, uh, not actually quite far from Taipei City. Therefore, if you are a tea lover, must, must visit their factory, okay? Next, the tea is also from Taiwan. This is uh, small packaging. This tea is called Ali Mountain Black Tea. This is from the Northern Tropical Region. In Mandarin, we call it Ali San Cha. Okay, let me see what else. To introduce so this tea is also planted in high mountain the process is it go through full oxidized process in order to offer a very unique flavor combine both the dense of black tea and the fresh sorry the fresh sense of high mountain tea. The color is a bit reddish. This is my stock actually. I already drink one of one of the one of this before. So both of the tea are from uh, Taiwan. I love it so much and I would love to buy more again. Let's move to the Japanese tea. Uh, Japanese tea, I already finished my hochi cha. I finished my green tea. Therefore, I, will, I am unable to show you. Uh, the only tea that left from, uh, from Japan is the matcha, matcha green tea. So, this type of matcha green tea, they already mixed with... Uh, mixed with milk as well therefore it is not the 100% pure okay not saying not not saying this tea is not pure it is just added milk however it is still a matcha tea there are a lot of different kind of matcha tea in the market right now they are matcha tea that already mixed with sugar this one mixed with mixed with milk there are original matcha tea only, which is no sugar added, nothing else added. It's only the powder of uh, powder of green tea. This type of tea is unlike any other tea that you can just boil hot water and then you pour in and then you can drink. This one actually need a type of. Um, a type of the bamboo brush is it look like a bamboo brush uh, where you put one or two teaspoon of the matcha tea into your glass 
and then you put a bit of hot hot water and then you have to grind it first uh, you have to like keep on blend blend and blend in order to get the aroma out of the, of the matcha tea then only you can drink uh, I will in future if I got opportunity I will record a video and then show you how do I make it uh, this one is easy to, to make just put hot water then done I can drink it oh yeah okay there is a there is a picture here showing the blend this is made of bamboo I'm not sure whether you can see it hopefully you can see it in the video something like this all right that's all from Japan sorry guys the green tea finished therefore I only can show you matcha tea Moving forward, let's go to China. My China tea also, a lot of them have finished, especially my Pu'er tea also finished already. Therefore, I only left some of this small packet tea. To be honest, until today, I still don't know what kind of tea this is. Uh, I just love the smell. This tea smells like chocolate. Seriously, it is, it is smell like chocolate. Um, I can't really read what's the name. I, I really, I can't really read, mm, sorry. I can't really read Mandarin. So I'm not sure what does this write actually. What does this word mean? Or any of the word mean? I just look at the, um, I just look at the instructions when I bought, when I bought the tea. But I love it so much. And I know this is from China. Lastly, I want to show you the tea that I bought from Vietnam. Yay! Yeah, Vietnam also have a big tea plantations. Uh, today, I want to show you jasmine tea. Hope you can see it. So, jasmine tea in Mandarin is called Mo Li Hua Cha. Uh, okay, let me see if there is any instructions. Sorry guys, when I buy this uh, Mo Li Hua Cha in, in Vietnam, they actually do not come in this pack packaging. Uh, it's actually in a container where they show me they let me smell and they explain to me what grade is the tea and if i like the smell then i buy so this is one of the tea that i bought from vietnam there are a few more tea that i bought from vietnam however i don't want to show all in the video because uh, everything is in this packaging and there are some uh, same grade uh, sorry, there are some uh, same tea but different grade. However, in future video, I am going to show you how do I boil my tea. How do I make my tea? So guys, that's all for today. I have shown you six of the tea that I have uh, at the moment on my hand. So... Next is going to show you how do I make tea in one of my video in the future. Hope you enjoyed my video today. Thank you for watching and have a fantastic Friday night guys. Bye bye.